Hooters investigated in an organized fashion with a home, with a home team where you go in as first scientific type of thing. Hey, Hooters never done this before. Yeah. Conversion. Yeah. Get them. I'm going to make you guys scream. Okay, here's the deal. This is a large group. I know a lot of you who have done this in an organized fashion have gone, how are we going to get good evidence in that? In a big group, if we work together, we've been really lucky and gotten some great evidence. This place has actually provided quite a bit of good evidence for us in big groups. So it can be done. We just have to work together. So, a couple of uh, pointers. Number one, flashlights are just for walking from point A to point B so you can kind of see where you're going. Eh, wrong button, there we go. Point at the ground. Don't be doing this to all your neighbors. <laughs> Thank Number you, Number so when your eyes are just as dark, some of us go, let's go over there. <laughs> Thank you, Amy. So please, and when it comes to flashlights, uh, bigger is not necessarily better. Okay? But you don't have to have a big man like this one. Oh, if you forgot flashlights, we have some for sale. They're any size. This is uh, you. Right here. Um, honestly, this is the most of the flashlight I normally use. You don't need a lot of light. Okay, so if we have a bunch of things. The other thing is, when you're walking or moving around, and I have this problem, don't sound like a word of buffalo. Try and walk nice and light as possible. Uh, the other thing is, when you're talking, I know we always say don't whisper, etc., etc., but keep your voice as low as possible. And if you decide to have a nice little gaggly conversation with your girlfriend about last week's party you went to, you can do that. But please leave the area and come back down here to do that. When we're doing investigating, Grant's famous three rules is shut up, shut up, and shut up. Please. Be respectful of everybody in the area. And that's about being in a big group. So, um, language, yeah, please make sure you have your badges on you and the language out. That's how we can tell that's who you are is who you are. For this particular group, you want this group. So, the other thing is we're going to divide you into five different groups because we have five locations. Please don't jump groups. This is your time right now to get in the people that you want to be with. Once you're with them, please stay with them. Basically, we've had experiences in the past. When people start jumping groups, they go, I want to stay with them the whole time they stay there. All of a sudden, we end up with a group that has 45 people in it and a group that has two. It really screws the people in the 45 group and the people who only have two that great time. So please stay here. Don't jump groups. Also, if you're drunk, it's time to go back to the bar. We'll ask you to leave. And you're not going to get on the problem. It's not the time to rank and uh, be loud and conscious. And you guys, um, if you feel uncomfortable at any time, don't be embarrassed or anything. Just grab one of us and be like, hey, I want to get out of here. Um, or you know, take a breather. Uh, it's totally fine. We've all been there. Um, and it happens sometimes. This is pretty intimidating. <laughs> <laughs> uh, also, I know that Brit makes it look really easy on TV to run after things in the dark. <laughs>